Good morning, it's just another beautiful day out here in paradise. And I got up real early, took the motorbike for a ride, and I just have been having an incredible day so far. I came back to the place I'm staying and had some breakfast and some coffee, and they make the most incredible pineapple jam here. I'd never had it before, and it is the way to eat toast, I will tell you. Riding the motorbike is the way to go. It's definitely the, way, the best way to experience this country because you get the smell, the feel, you get to interact with people along the way. It is incredible. I think I understand the way that the roads work now. It's just interesting how all the vehicles play with each other and everyone gets around. I actually think I prefer the way that they drive here than the way it is in the United States because people can go slow and people can go fast all on the same road and the center divider doesn't really matter. It's just all about making calculated decisions on when to pass and when to hang back. So I've been having a good time driving around. But as you can probably hear, my voice is going away. I said I was getting sick last night and I woke up this morning and I was like, Ugh, I'm dying. So I'm not gonna do too much talking today, but I won't let it slow me down because that's just how I am. Check out my amazing view for breakfast. This is just outside my door. Now it's time for a shower. I had a good day exploring today on the motorbike, but I will say you have to ride those things like they're dirt bikes here because basically only the main road is paved well and the rest is either rocky or uh, kind of two concrete paths for a car to drive down and those are not very smooth themselves. But so I met some great people on my tour that uh, I will definitely stay in contact with and I was speaking with one of them today and he was telling me that you don't really need a temporary driver's license here as long as you're wearing a helmet. They won't pull you over for any, because they don't have any reason to. And uh, I'm definitely always wearing the helmet because crashing could happen at any time out here because the roads are kind of crazy. Definitely more exploration to come. I'm gonna go do a hike tomorrow and then the next day it's off to uh, Ubud which I'm super excited for, so stay tuned. Alright, so I just flew the drone and these guys have been here the whole time. They don't speak English, but all they want to do is take photos with me and it's been so funny. Look at there they are. These guys are hilarious. Well, as you saw, the sunset was incredible, but those guys were stealing the show because they're just hilarious. The entire time they just wanted to hang out and see what I was doing and take photos with me. And uh, I think I just took more selfies in a five minute period than I have in my entire life. But I had a great day. 
It's been really fun seeing this different side of Bali that you wouldn't normally see in a YouTube video. I'm really excited to get after it again tomorrow. <laughs>